I'm Peter King, I'm a resident of uh, Lang Warren here in the city of Frankston. I'm the secretary of the Frankston Yacht Club and tonight I've attended the community consultation for the South East Water plans for the new corporate head office. I really like the design of the building and how it sits on the creek. I think there's some real positives for the city of Frankston at this time. Uh, Karen from the Greater Frankston Business Chamber, just to say how wonderful it is to see South East Water coming to our great city and it will be a wonderful development for everybody to enjoy on the foreshore. Uh, God, I hope it's not 29 storeys, but uh, yeah, I think the way the height they're going is will be quite sufficient and it will just enhance the foreshore. It's a fantastic thing for the region. I think it'll be a really great boost for the economy, for the local population and for the surrounding regions. It, luckily they're not planning on putting a basements in the ground but uh, the bad point is the height right beside the creek and Frankston so I hope they work it out if it were, wasn't so high I wouldn't be so concerned it's going to be a great opportunity for Frankston lots of new employment for the local area so looking I'm really excited about it you live around Frankston? No, I don't actually. Okay. No, but I work. I'm here every day, of course. We've got here is actually an unprecedented economic boost for um, Frankston. It's it's a once in a generation. We're talking about 700 jobs, um, and that's that's office based employment um, that we're bringing in at the moment. There's uh, 2,000, just over 2,000 jobs, white collar office jobs in the Frankston city centre. So this is going to increase by 30% in one hit. So the enormity of this this economic boost is um, not to be underestimated. The other factors are that there'll be another 300 jobs during construction over a couple of years. And um, the spin-off effects are, are going to be huge. So more than 450 jobs will be created through the supply chain, through other businesses that are supplying contractors to South East Water. And there'll also be fantastic, uh, fantastic education outcomes. There's going to be something like $10 million do uh, pumped into um, food, cafes, restaurants, and also retail in the area. So 700 people injection Every day, every working day in Frankston is going to have a huge impact. The location's fantastic as well. South East Water on the water. Um, it's a, it's a, as I said before, once in a generation boost for Frankston. I have to say that uh, there was some interesting things up there, but yeah. I really believe that this isn't the right place for South East Water to build their building. And I'd really like to see South East Water in Frankston at another location. I love yeah. our beach. We have the best beach in the world. We have a wonderful foreshore area and we don't need to become St Kilda or Docklands or Surface Paradise. I like to keep it simple and enjoy those simple things, so. Okay, I think the building is, the put in some effort to make it look like a, a, a nice building but quintessential Frankston doesn't have buildings on the foreshore of that size and it's as simple as that um, and once that goes you'll never get it back again so I'm very much happy to see um, South East Water come to Frankston and I think there's some terrific spots in the Central Activities District of Frankston that would suit but it's just not going to suit there. The access is going to be a problem. Um, and it's just far too close to what is quintessentially Franks and what you see on all the promotion, the pier, the beach, and all that promotional will have basically a building overshadowing it. 